Hello everybody and welcome back to Fail Project Games. Here we are with more of Spider-Man. Wish I could do something to help Doc. Maybe call Harry. Ask him to talk to his dad. Norman never listens to Harry. He even tried to kill funding for his research stations. Hey, one of those stations is nearby. You should see how they're doing while Harry's in Europe. There must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. Oh, there it is. the robbery at Roseman's auction house. What you probably didn't, but my sources confirm, is that the perpetrators were wearing masks. Harry left me a message about these before he left for me. Pete, hey, I need a favor. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now, I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's gonna shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is, too. Well, it's not gonna pay the bills, but it sounds like it means a lot to him. I'll do what I can to help. got a couple stations measuring air pollution. The idea is to catch the, oh, what's the word, contaminants before they reach toxic levels. Between you and me, I think Oscorp wants this to fail because it might show they're polluting. The amount of polycyclic hydrocarbons in the air is way too high and rising. If it keeps getting worse, people could die. Particles are concentrating in trouble spots, like mini clouds of smog. I'll swing through them and get samples, then trace them to the source. Nasty as they are, I gotta swing right through those clouds. These clouds to be visible to the naked eye. The level of toxins must be up there. And gotcha. Good stuff. Well, good samples of bad stuff, anyway. <coughs> Got it. <coughs> oh, oh. oh, feels like I'm breathing from a tailpipe. <coughs> Ha! <laughs> 
Huh. The toxin's coming from two types of cars. And a faulty smokestack. I better get photos. on that one. Best smokestack picture I ever took. The Department of Environmental Protection will take it from here. I should make a green spider costume for Earth Day. Well, Harry Station just stopped a public health crisis. Oscorp's gonna have a hard time arguing it's not useful. Spider-Man, Shocker has escaped, and now he's robbing a bank on East 31st. What happened? I thought he was behind bars. He was, but one of the guards just walked up to his cell and released him, then gave him his suit back. I knew Shocker was working for someone. What did you get out of the guard? Wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any loose ends. Damn. Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bank. Peter, I've been looking into the demons. Sounds like they've quietly established a power base in the vacuum left by Fisk. A vacuum I created by putting Fisk away? Jameson was right. The demons are my fault. What were you supposed to do? Let Fisk keep godfathering? Are you okay? You sound even mopier than usual. I think I might have just lost my job. The city, Norman actually, pulled our funding. Oh, Pete. I'm sorry. If Harry were here, he could talk some sense into his dad. He'll find another source. Your work's too important. Thanks, MJ. Talk to you soon. Herman! Long time no see. Hey, I'm no lawyer, but, uh, I'm pretty sure that's a parole violation. Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Wanna play 20 questions? No? How about we thumb us? Okay, face punch it is. Whoa! Your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You want to fight? Let's fight! Man, 
can't wait to put you back behind bars so we can talk science. Remember our first fight? Me so young and stupid? You just stupid! You talk too much! Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, are there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? And who determines the ideal ratio of talking versus not talking? Also, how would you measure? Words per minute? Syllables per second? Or is it more about how many words one uses to express a single thought? It's all so subjective. If you ask me, some people don't talk enough. Think about who their mysterious overlord is. The person they're working for, that kind of thing. Stop! Stand still! If you ask nicely, maybe. Okay, now I can do some real damage. <laughs> Why are you doing this, Herman? Because if I don't, they'll kill me! Interesting. Remember our first fight? Me, so young and stupid? You, just stupid! You talk to me! Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, are there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? And who determines the ideal ratio of talking versus not? Okay, now I can do some real damage. Why are you doing this, Herman? Because if I don't, they'll kill me! Shit. Coming your way! You come clean, I can help you! You really want to help me? Let me have the anymore you're lucky you found actual cash if you really want to rob banks try day trade it's all the rage oh come on herman you tell me who you're working for i can help you cut a deal if i talk i'm dead they made that very clear Shit. Shit. Oh, fuck my life. How am I supposed to dodge that? That's tough. <laughs> you tell me who you're working for. I can help you cut a deal. If I talk, I'm dead. They made that very clear. Give up now and we 
can protect you! No way! You ain't see what I see! No. Okay, last chance to give up. This time I really mean it. We're going. <coughs> okay, I was kidding before. Oh, now, fuck. Get your last, last chance. Seriously. Oh, this is gonna be fucking awesome. You brought this on yourself. Literally. I expected more than that, but alright. Alright guys, it's gonna be it for this one. We will see you next time on Fail Project Games. Later. Okay, Yuri. Oh, Doctor's hold on. Yuri's talking. Good work. We have a special cell waiting for him at the raft. We'll make sure he stays behind bars this time. Also, I'm pretty sure he was working for the Demon Gang. Demon Gang? <sighs> Sounds like a Daily Bugle headline. Hey, the Bugle is a perfectly fine news organization. Not sure I'd call it news. Well, I've heard they have some really good reporters. Anyway. Have you had any more reports on demon, uh, uh, guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way, how much of a mess did you make inside that bank? You probably don't want to know. <sighs> Shouldn't have asked. <laughs> Alright guys, this is it for this one. We will see you. Jesus. We will see you next time. Later.